Hey guys, how's it going? This is Summer Pankoff with Board Riders Review. We're down here talking to Frank from Nine Fish. We're going to talk about some of the board shapes that he's got going on and, and tell you a little bit about them. We have a, a number of shapers. Uh, Clyde Beatty Jr. oversees all of our shapers. Um, our, uh, our board designers, uh, two of our major board designers are owners of our company, uh, Sonny and Wes. And uh, they're both engineers. Uh, I'm an engineer as well. And uh, basically, the, they do all the engineering in the boards to uh, make the boards easy to ride and uh, fun. That's the hammerhead. This is an epoxy. It also comes in a fiberglass. Um, you can order it either way. What are these ones right here? Are these an epoxy boards? That's epoxy boards tend to run a little bit thinner than the fiberglass boards. They're a little bit thinner? Yeah. Is that is that because they're, uh, they're more lighter? Or? Uh, you know, they weigh about the same. We use a uh, six and six glass on the top and the bottom for uh, both of our styles of boards. And what kind of, you guys just kind of have like a flat bottom here? You guys do any concaves in your shaping or is it just kind of all flat? Um, the engineering in our board basically is to make the whole board flat very little rocker, no concaves, no V's out the tail, nothing like that, completely flat. And what this does is we make it thicker and flat. So basically you have a lot of wave touching the water. A lot of the board touches the water. So when the wave comes, you're pushing the whole board forward. Just gonna make it easier to catch waves. Okay, nice. What about this board right there? This board looks kind of cool. It's got this little thicker nose and super thin tail. What kind of board is that? What ways do you guys that board on? It's Barracuda T, it's epoxy, uh, it's a 6'4", um, stringer tail, definitely for uh, bigger waves, winter wintertime surfing. You could surf it in the summer, but uh, I would recommend in the winter. Um, you know, this is for definitely uh, someone who wants to get into a bigger wave and, uh, you know, do a little bit tighter surfing, a little more technical surfing in the bigger waves. Single fin, you can also get it in a twin fin. This board's got like a thicker nose. What does a thicker nose do? How does that act out on the wave? Well, so again, Summer, the thickness of our boards has to do with getting you up on the water. We want you to plane out really easily. We want you to be able to paddle real easily. The easier it is for you to paddle, the more energy you're going to have to paddle for more waves. You're going to in turn catch more waves and in turn become a better rider. Uh, you know, our goal at Nine Fish is to do one thing, to help you catch more waves. That's, that's our main focus. We want everybody to surf and we want people to catch waves. The best servers are the ones having the most fun. That's right. <laughs> that's definitely true. <laughs> So there's no there's no stringer in this board right here. There is a stringer in this board. There is board. a stringer. Yeah, you just can't this see a, it. Yeah, this is an epoxy board. Okay. This also comes in a, a fiberglass model as well. Okay. This is our seared ahi. This is our number one selling board. Uh, it's a six two, um, probably the most versatile board. Um, if there is one board you're gonna have in your quiver, um, it would be this board. It's a great board for someone who wants to step off of a you know an egg fun shape eight foot size board you know eight and a half feet seven and a half feet somewhere in there that wants to step down get in something more maneuverable uh something that's going to be uh, a lot shorter but uh still get them in to the wave early enough to where they have time to uh you know adjust their speed and also you know uh work work with the wave so All right now would this be would this board be like for your size your size guy Oh yeah, definitely. I mean, you know, like uh, we have we have guys who surf this board that are over six feet tall, you know, over 200 pounds, surf this board with no problem. Uh, we have guys that are a lot smaller, you know, five and a half feet, you know, 150 pounds that still surf this board and have a great time. You know, I mean, uh, you know, size to weight ratio on this board is 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 really it's it's a big big number of people that could actually fit on it. But uh, you know, again, this board is is a board that's going to get you into waves when it's small and it's also going to handle the waves when they get big. So that's what makes this board so all around good. But you said this board was used for some tow-ins? Um, yeah, we have some guys in Hawaii that tow in on that board. This is a clownfish. It's a 5.4. It comes in a flavor of a 5.10 as well. We call that the XL clownfish. Um, these boards are definitely, uh, when you ride them as a twin fin, definitely going to get looser. Um, you're going to want to ride it as a twin fin when it's small, 
mushy summertime waves. Once you get into the wintertime, gets up over four foot, you can throw in that center fin and this board tracks really well. What kind of model is this board here? Uh, that's our that's our Grunion 2. That's a 5.8. It's a quad. Uh, it's an epoxy. This also comes in a fiberglass model as well. Um, this board is definitely a step uh, step down board for someone who uh, maybe has ridden the ahi for a while, somebody who's uh, familiar with riding fishes and uh, wants to get into something a little bit shorter and a little bit more maneuverable again. Um, this board is a fantastic board for, uh, you know, good head high, couple feet overhead um, waves. Surfs great in the summertime with the quad. You can ride it as a 20 and loosen it up. Um, this board is really fun. We have we have surfers uh, down in El Salvador that surf this board religiously, so uh, it's a great board. Really fun. Probably uh, one of my favorites. One thing about this board, because it's 5.8, it seems seems to take off really fast. And uh, when you get up on it, though, uh, it really likes to turn, really likes to carve, really likes to be drawn out. And uh, surprisingly enough, it actually seems to uh, want to hunt for barrels every once in a while too. So really fun board. Like surfing it at Del Mar a lot. What about this board? Longboard model, it's like a longboard fish. Yeah, this is this is a koi. It's a longboard fish. It's a twin fin. It's uh, it's an eight four. Uh, this is an epoxy. Uh, comes to about twenty three and a half inches in the middle, so a little wider. But again, uh, the engineering that's gone into it has made it completely flat. Very little rocker, no V, nothing like that. Um, this board's really fun to surf. Comes out, comes out into the wave really great. And uh, real easy to uh, to uh, surf on. Great, great board to learn on. If you're looking for a fish and uh, you're learning how to surf at the same time, this would be a great board to go with. This board looks fun. It is fun. <laughs> All right, we're gonna go test out these boards for ourselves and see how they ride. Cool, Summer. So, what do you think? Yeah, I like the boards. They're killer. I like that little five four. It's nice, easy paddle super loose when he got up on the wave. I had some fun on that one. Caught the rails a couple times though. I think a couple more sessions and I'll, I'll have fun on that board. Uh, definitely that, what was that? Is that ahi? Seared ahi? Seared ahi. It made me hungry. I'm ready to eat. <laughs> <laughs> but I had fun on that board too. Yeah, I thought it was a little stiff. It definitely paddled in the waves super easy. You're going to catch a lot of waves on that board. It's definitely fun. Great summer. Well, thanks a lot for coming out and trying the boards. We really appreciate it. And, uh, you know, Nine Fish, uh, catch waves and uh, get hungry. Catch us at ninefishsurf.com and uh, get stoked. Go surf. Have fun. Yeah, this is Frank with Nine Fish. Uh, go to Board Riders Review. Stoked.